going on everybody? I am Pixel Dan and I am spending the weekend at the Indiana Toy and Comic Expo with Spidey right here. This is my BFF Spidey at the show. Oh, hey, what's going on, buddy? How are you? Nothing. Would you like this whole uh, take on me jog around? I, awesome. I saw that. It was awesome. What? There's another Spider-Man. There's another Spider-Man. There are so many Spider-Mans here. I don't we even know what's going Deadpool. on. Oh, no. We're coming for you, Wade. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. You get, you're getting webbing all over my camera, guys. Let's calm down a little bit. Let's just stop. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on, now I gotta clean this thing. So, Indiana Toy and Comic Expo is a really cool little convention. This is actually my third year at the show. Um, and they've brought me out every year and actually give me a little bit of a table space. So we've, here's Stina right here. Say hi, Stina. So we've been sitting here and selling some shirts and selling some Pixel Dan pins and got a few extra toys on the table. I've been meeting a lot of really great people today. And it's crazy because I've been so busy sitting here talking that I haven't had a lot of time to go out and look at the show floor. And I think the show's only open for a couple more hours. So I figured now I'm gonna grab you guys and we're gonna hit the show floor and we're gonna do a little toy hunting and see what we can find out there. So let's do it, yeah. <laughs> something amazing over here <laughs> so we got to get in here and we got to look at the brand new warlords of war figures awesome. I've been so excited about these and obviously I've been loving Bognar for a long time I wear that shirt every day <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> People see it in my videos. videos. Yep, 20% of my videos. I'm wearing Bognar shirts and now You got yourself full production Bognar figures, which is amazing. I'm really excited for you, man. Thank you very much. And you're gonna be selling these online soon, right? Yes, at nine o'clock Eastern tonight at uh, manormonsterstudios.limitedrun.com. Brand new Boom. store site for me. Boom. I will put a link in the video description so you guys can check these out online because they're amazing and everybody needs these in their collection. <laughs> Bognar! This is a very special convention because not only is Stina here, but Spencer's here too. Say hi. Say hi, Spencer. Wave. 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 Yeah. This is actually the only convention Spencer's really been to, right? Yeah. Do you like this show? You want to show him what you got? What'd you get? What'd you find here? Did you get some toys? He got some dinosaurs, right? You love dinosaurs? Yeah. 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 Spencer loves those dinos. Oh, what else you got? He was really excited about this rhino figure, so we had to get it for him. What else? Oh, and he's got Hopper. And a grasshopper. Oh, Grasshopper. Yep, Grasshopper. And who else did you get? Pico. Figures. What are those figures from? Uh, Voltron. Voltron. Yay! These Disney figures are awesome. I don't know if you guys have ever seen these before, but I love these. They're like the Disney heroes. This Hercules is so rad. Look at that. And then they did like a different scale too, the, like the Adventures figures, and they're kind of cool. It's Tarzan and Aladdin, but I love these. These are awesome. And Hercules is sweet. All right, let's see what we got over here. There's a lot of treasure here. You know what I mean by treasure, right? I mean stone protectors. You know it. <laughs> Actually, check this out. Fortress of Fangs. Woo, man. Got some street sharks goodness in here. Those are always cool to see. And this guy. 
<laughs> All right. Hey guys. Now I'm over here with Jason from Spiro Studios, and you've got something here that you're kind of like debuting to the world, right? Yeah, we're showing off our prototype three and three quarter figures. What? What? Yeah. So you guys just kickstarted these recently, right? This we, is we finished up in July. Anim and, uh, Animal Warriors of the Kingdom is the name of the line, right? Right. And we call it AWOC for short. AWOC. I like that. Yeah. Like so uh, they're anthropomorphic uh, animal warriors, and, and we're going to be doing apes, canines, and felines in our first wave. And we're actually working on deluxe figures, which will be closer to six inch because they're in scale with these particular figures. Really? Oh, that is awesome. Yeah, we're going to be doing gorillas and bears and uh, rhinos and, and water oxes. Oh my. Oh. Hashtag Gosh. free thing. Hashtag free thing. Our, our gorilla's called thing, so we say free thing. Oh, I like it. I like it. These are looking great, man. Thank like you so much. the prototypes look awesome here on display. Um, what's the uh, timeline for these actually coming out? Well, we had originally said November of 2018. Yeah. We're hearing uh, closer to summer of 2018. So okay. We're, we're so that's ahead good. Of schedule. Moving which right is along. Norm. Right. We're very happy about that. Uh, these figures feature interchangeable armor. So if you want to cross-play with G.I. Joe or Ooh, Vitruvian Axe, you can yeah. do that. And I know I'm going to personally do that. Oh, for time. sure. Yeah. Yeah, we, we're really excited about the line, and uh, we're just kind of getting started. So. Sweet. And it's, you got like a graphic novel, too, right? We do. We actually of. sold out of our graphic novel, but uh, the figure line's based on our, our graphic novel called The Kingdom, and this is our other graphic novel, which is uh, that thriller called Dusk. Sweet. So yeah, we got a lot of stuff going on, and uh, we're super excited to kind of get out to the world and let everyone know where we're Wow. Excellent, so. excellent. And how's the ordering work on this? Do you have right here, check that out. Boom! Look at that. We currently have the back of kits still open, so if you want to, if you missed out on the Kickstarter, you can go ahead and, and order the the figures that way. And uh, we have this little brochure right here that shows the initial offering from the Kickstarter. Sweet. We actually unlock two additional figures, so whenever you visit the website, you'll be able to see the two figures that uh, weren't shown in the brochure. Excellent. And what's that website? Uh, you know what? It's, it's right just there. back. Oh, there it's, it is. It's animal. Let's see. It's AWOC Series One backerkit.com <laughs> slash hosted <laughs> underscore pre-orders. That's the best. It's easiest to remember easy. website ever. I'll make sure I put that in the uh, the video description. You How can also that? go to SpiroToys.com and that will actually send you there a lot quicker. And there easy. we go. SpiroToys.com. Check these guys out because these figures are looking amazing, and I can't wait to see the final product. Thank you so much. Congratulations, guys. Thank you this very is awesome. Much. Really appreciate it. Sweet. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Oh, this is awesome. Whole row of gargoyles here. Look at that. And then like up here, some really nice looking visionaries. Look at that. This is the kind of thing, you don't see these very often. At least I don't see these very often when I'm out toy hunting. Now they're all priced around 20 to 30, which I get. Uh, but man, those are sweet. Look at those holograms. Modern toys need more holograms. Am I right? <laughs> the cool Star World figure case. The artwork is amazing on these. Look at that. That's wonderful. And the one behind it is even different. Look at that. Gosh. Holds up to 12 space figures. But only space figures. Beetlejuice Phantom Flyer. Love it. Hey, I'm flying high now. So these these are great. These are um, the modern Nickelodeon TMNT action figures, but these are the versions from Japan. So the card backs look a little different. You can see actually, I, I kind of feel like these are a little bit nicer. The artwork on the back there. And then there's also 
Toddler turtles, ninjas in training. So they got them up here too. How sweet are those? Those are really, really great. Not something you see out in the wild, obviously, very often. But uh, yeah, this is what they were packaged in in Japan. Pretty cool stuff. Okay, so these Toy Biz Marvel vehicles always crack me up. I have always loved this, the Magneto Magnetron, because that's just, that's just so ridiculous, right? And then down here, we've got the Sky Cycle for the Avengers. We've got Hawkeye riding the Sky Cycle. But seriously, Magneto Magnetron. Uh, amazing. Oh, it's nerd therapy! <laughs> What's Hi. up, guys? What are you guys doing here? Well, we're just, you know, watching Spider Man. Hanging out. Spider Man's are over here just doing backflips. Yeah. They're like. Dance battle going on. They were doing, they were, they, earlier they saw me filming and they all came up and started hugging me, getting all up in my space. Don't you hate I mean, when people do that? <laughs> I know, it's super weird. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so look, you guys made me, for the second year in a row, you made me an amazing custom Pixel Dan Pop figure. Mega and Dan. It's Mega Dan, yeah, so it's Mega Man, but it's me, so it's Mega Dan. Mega I like Dan's it, it's good. good, it's good. Yeah, it's good. good uh, but it's, it's in my suitcase already, so I'm gonna put a picture right here so everybody can see it. But I want to thank you guys, because you're amazing. No, you're amazing, and that's why we made it for you. No, you're amazing. Everybody knows Every who's watching it. No, movie. so everybody needs to go watch you guys if they're not already, except I think everybody already does, because everybody always gets excited when I talk about you. They're like, oh, we love them! See? We got called it's cute cool. today. Yeah, cute. Oh, yeah. you're the cute one. You guys, the cute, ones. the cute ones who talk about toys. <laughs> Every time Christina's on a video with me, I get that a lot, too. You guys are adorable. Are you coming yeah. next year? I will be here next year, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I will tell you this. Okay. I've got something planned. Oh. That's going to be awesome. You're already planning something, like a year out? He already knows what it is. It's going to be awesome. I'm excited. Now I have to sit here for a year so in I've, anticipation. I've, yes, I've drug you here next year. <laughs> you drug me, I, now I have to come. Yes. So even if it was in an, like if Billy, the guy who runs the show, he's like, hey, we don't need you, Pixel Dan. I'd be like, no, I'm, I'm you coming. You have to come, I promise because... you. I promise you. <laughs> I have to get whatever whatever's happening here. It's I have gonna to see be it. exquisite. Okay, exquisite. Well, exquisite. I like that. Put a little thing in I like there. that. Like a little sound effect. I'll add the sound and effect. I, I, I work <laughs> Thanks for making me edit this more than I have to. This is supposed to be my simple editing. It's just <laughs> Go watch these guys. Nerd Therapy. Go check them out. Follow them on the socials and the twit books and stuff. They're That's there. social media. They're stuff. everywhere. You guys are the best. <laughs>
we have got to get to Terre Haute, Indiana to see this store. I'm gonna come yeah. see your store sometime. Yeah. I'm gonna be there. That's awesome. So today's been really, really great because there's been a lot of people who have actually come to see me uh, to tell me that they, they love the videos and everything and to support me by getting some t-shirts and stuff and that really, really means the world to me. Uh, and some of these people bring me gifts, which is absolutely amazing. Like I just, I showed you guys the the awesome little uh, the custom Zorn made from the He-Man Little Subjects figure there just a second ago, which is awesome. But I want to show you some of the other things that I was gifted. I got another custom pop figure, which is amazing when people make uh, custom figures like of me. That just blows me away. But what's really cool about this is this was entered into the custom figure contest here at the show. Um, somebody made a Pixel Dan pop. Uh, this was done by Custom Crazy 64 on Instagram, so shout out to them for bringing this by. Uh, they were amazing, talked to them both for a very long time. But what I love about this, like he's holding a power sword, which is awesome, but they even printed my Comparison Time logo for my t-shirt on the actual t-shirt there. Mind blowing. I love this. This is absolutely amazing. So very, very cool stuff. And then um, a viewer named Justin stopped by and he brought me this. Now if you watched my recent toy hunting video from San Diego Comic Con, you might remember that I saw one of these there and I freaked out and I didn't buy it. This is a vintage Spinges set. And I have never owned one of these before. And he said he saw it in that video and he had one from when he was a kid and he's not not ever done anything with it since so he wanted me to have it and that's just that's incredible so look at this it opens up and here I'm gonna go ahead and grab the camera here now I'm gonna show you guys this check this out so you open this case up you've got your little launchers here which is amazing two little launchers and then in the little foam here in the middle we got these amazing little die cast metal spinjas a little little uh, fighting figures here uh, this is awesome. This is so cool. Let's see if I can get a good focus on this. So, yeah, look at that. Really, really cool little guys. And then this closes up like this, just like that. Thank you, Stina, for your help. So that turns into the ring to battle them. So I think I got to try this now, right? We got we to gotta try this. We got to make this happen. Let's do it. You got to hold it right here. Hold it up, just like that. Right there. Okay, ready, set. Oh, go, 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 look, they're gonna fight. Go, 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 oh, 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 I think you won. Yay! All right, you ready? Yeah. Ready to do this? Yeah. Ready, set, go. Oh, go, go, oh, yeah. Mine one, mine one. <laughs> go. Oh, oh, you got me. Oh, you got me. Oh, you won. Yeah. You win. Yay! Well, I think that is going to put a cap on the Indiana Toy and Comic Expo. Uh, the day is ending. You can see that the show floor is emptying out. It's about time for me to get packed up and going as well. Saw a lot of cool things out there on the show floor. Uh, like I said, I didn't really get to get out there until the very end of the show, so I apologize that I didn't get to show you guys a ton of cool stuff, but I hope you liked seeing what you did see. Uh, I didn't pick up a lot of stuff uh, personally. The only thing that I ended up, did, I, I ended up grabbing is one of those Star Star World cases, like the knockoff uh, Star Wars cases, because I thought that was amazing. But also, in addition to that, I did pick up the new Warlords of War figures. I got that new Bognar there, which is amazing. And then, of course, I've got the awesome Spinges and the cool other things that were gifted to me. So, definitely still an amazing day. Had a lot of fun here, and I can't wait to come back next year for the Indiana Toy and Comic Expo. So if you guys are in the Bloomington, Indiana area, check the show out next year. It's a lot of fun, and I'll be here. It's, it's a good time. Thank you guys, as always, for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned, because I'll be doing more of these toy hunting videos as I'm going to other shows in the next couple months here. So stay tuned. Leave me a comment, hit that subscribe. You guys know, you guys know the drill. Do all that stuff. Until next time, my friends.